Okay then guys, today the new video is is the TLC14 uh, WS ARGB fans from Thermal Right worth it. Continue to watch. Right, so let's uh, have a look. Now what uh, the, like, what I like about these uh, fans is the fact that the 140s uh they do look really nice they look really nice for the illumination of the rgb take them out for a minute now i have done a, a recording of the uh the sound levels which unfortunately at 1500 rpm they're very loud but now what I do like about these fans is the fact that the PWM connector but here is individually sleeved. Look at that. Really nice. That's a nice touch. That's a really nice touch from any brand. I don't think any other brand braids their <laughs> the PWM connector. As far as I'm concerned, any fans I've received so far haven't been braided. So that's good that's a plus in my book personally uh they're quite loud at 1500 rpm but at 1000 rpm they're very very silent you can't hear them uh they are adjustable they are a, a, a rgb uh the pack does come with this um what's call it it does come with these little things, these rubber grommets by here. This is to stop any noise. It does come with a splitter and it also comes, whoop, and there's just screws coming out everywhere. Okay, that'll stick there. Comes with this little, um, this little thing by here, which, as you can see, I haven't even used. It's because I've already got so many set up in my, my case might as well just use the the um controls i've already got so this is the controller it comes with which i'm having a yeah that's it there we go that's it yeah, rip it off let's just rip it off that's it bloody hell right there we go <laughs> right so it comes with this little controller by here that does connect to a three pin ARGB on your motherboard and it is connected by SATA. So all it does really is it gives you modes, gives you speeds, and then you can either uh, you can either sync it to your motherboard or you can have this just automatically do it for you. Uh, the default on majority of ARGB fan controllers is RGB pook, which I'm not the fa best fan of. I mean, it's not my exactly the, my preferred color color like, but uh, well, mine's white and purple, so that just goes to say. Uh, it comes with this nifty little uh, three pin splitter from a four pin to three four pin header. Uh, I ha already had one in my system for um, the Be Quiet fans, so I use that instead exactly the same one just in black and that seems to be it with the accessories now if you haven't seen the uh, unboxing video I suggest go watching it because it shows you everything here uh, but for the fans they have got a quality feel to them they do push a lot of air I will say I understand that the bigger the fan the more air it does push but at 1500 rpm this blows so much air it's unbelievable um my system went down about a degree or two just by installing these in the front so my uh, vrms are usually uh the idle between 39 and 40 degrees so but obviously i've got a tower cooler in there so that's keeping it cool but when i installed these it went down about it went down to like 37 38 degrees so it went down a few degrees a couple of degrees which was quite impressive but and this is the big but is the noise now i will insert i would have inserted the uh recording i done on my phone of the noise of the fans and 
my recommendation is if you want 140 fans yes there are better options out there like the light wings but these are white they do come with individual uh pwm braided cables the uh the RG argb is very nice the illumination is very nice they do push a ton of a ton of air and <clears throat> they come with these little rubber stoppers on the side to stop the vibrations so i recommend them but obviously there's only one set of fans i didn't recommend them that was the etsy fans but yeah go see that video that's quite interesting so yeah i recommend them i think they're worth it uh they are around uh 55 to 60 pound it's a bit hard to get uh to actually get a price because they aren't in the uk or the u in europe they're overseas it's it's kind of hard to find the price in but it's around 55 to 60 pounds so they're not a bad it's not a bad deal for argb fans special 140s so yeah don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and also i've got more content coming from bits power i've also uh, reached out to secret labs i've reached out to a lot of different brands uh, a few have replied and a few are seeming positive so make sure you subscribe for more for further content in the future and this is richard from welsh tech i hope you have a fantastic day goodbye